right now I'm talking about the weather and there is something to talk about because we have had not only the clouds but a little bit of rain in some of our neighborhoods here today. Most of you have stayed nice and dry but we check out the visible satellite right now and you can start to see with that band of clouds coming in and this is associated with a weak cold front some breaks in the clouds out there so we're seeing a few more peaks of that blue sky and sunshine moving through. We've got more sunshine out along the coast and we'll be back to that full sunshine into tomorrow. It's a mostly clean scan here on radar outside of maybe just a few lingering sprinkles here and there. Most of the rain continues to dry up. Still have some showers over the central part of the state, the Triangle area, Raleigh, Durham, Chapel Hill, and out toward the Finger Counties in northeastern North Carolina. And there's still the chance of a little bit of rain, mainly south and east of Charlotte for another few hours until that boundary completely clears the area. And it will later on tonight, so then we're back to that clearing sky. Temperatures today, though, still nice and mild, warming up into the mid 70s. You've got 74 right now in the historic West End. Checking out conditions in the Queen City here with the west southwest wind at 8. Getting a little breezy here from time to time. Of course, we're up on the roof, but uh, relative, relative humidity sitting close to 40%. They've had some lower 80s there. Chesterfield County was at 81 last hour, now back down to 77 with some of those thicker clouds rolling in. Low 70s down in other parts of South Carolina from Chester into Lancaster. We've got 71 in Shelby and right around 60 for you all in the mountains. So later on tonight, it's going to feel very similar to how it felt last night and heading out the door earlier this morning with temperatures only bottoming out in the low 50s to start the day. We'll start at about 50, 51 degrees and then get back into the mid 70s tomorrow afternoon. The difference will be a lot more sunshine from sunrise up until sunset and it will be totally dry tomorrow. But now let's talk about Friday. So what's happening, this boundary sagging to the south, we're going to get that lifting back north as a warm front. So then you can see that band of a little more rain creeping in by Friday morning, Friday afternoon, especially to the west of Charlotte, up in the mountains and foothills. It's not going to be much rain again if you see it at all. Saturday is looking a little bit drier but maybe not totally dry with a couple of light showers still in the mix there and again best chance will be up in the mountain communities into the afternoon and then Sunday is looking a little bit drier as high pressure starts to take over and that's going to set the stage for some drier conditions going into next week and much warmer temperatures as well. You can see a hint of that as we take a look at the mountain forecast for tomorrow. Beautiful sunshine highs in the mid 60s a little bit cooler with the clouds and the showers around for you all on Friday and it will actually be a cooler day everywhere for Friday. Saturday clouds hang on. Sunday is looking brighter and those high temperatures back in the mid 70s in the mountains going into next week. But with this ridge of high pressure building in, it's definitely a warmer, unseasonably warm outlook. Kind of like last week we were talking about highs up in the 80s and close to 90 in spots. We have a repeat of that coming for next week. So get ready. It's going to start to feel a little more like summertime again. But later on tonight, this is what we'll uh, eventually bottom out to those temperatures and heading outside tomorrow morning, upper 40s to around 50. So just a few degrees cooler. We'll have a few spots in the higher elevations dropping into the upper 30s. And then for tomorrow's highs back in the mid 60s for you all in the mountains. Again, beautiful Thursday to get outside and enjoy. Soak up some of that sunshine before the clouds roll back in on Friday. We'll end up in the low to mid 70s, mostly mid 70s. And there you can see in Chesterfield County, always one of the warmer spots at about 70 nine degrees. Seven day forecast shows the cooler conditions coming in for Friday. It'll be a struggle to break out of the 60s during the day. Still not bad, but then we're back in the 70s on Saturday. Small, small chance of showers and then Sunday we're a little bit drier. That's when the warm stretch kind of kicks in and we may have to watch for with the daytime heating a few of those spotty storms by the middle of next week. Brian and Annie.